A special shout out to one of my most avid fans, Connor TDM. Giganotosaurus versus Sora Phaganax. Interesting name. It's the giant southern lizard versus the Lord of the Lizard Eaters. Giganotosaurus lived in what is now Argentina during the early Cenomanian age of the late Cretaceous period, approximately 98 to 97 million years ago. Saurophaganax is a genus of allosaurid dinosaur from the Morrison Formation of late Jurassic Oklahoma and lived around 150 million years ago. Some paleontologists consider it to be a species of Allosaurus and would like to name it A. Maximus. Sounds awesome. Some fans claim that Saurophaganax might have evolved into Giganotosaurus. Is it possible? Who knows? But who would win in a fight? Well, let's find out. First, some stats. Giganotosaurus. Height at hips, 4 meters, maybe 5 meters at head. Length, 14 meters is possible. Weight, 6 to 8 tons average. Larger specimens could have been up to 15 tons. Bite force. I previously stated 4.5 tons, but upon additional research, I have to revise it down to 1 or 2 tons. Speed. Some scientists claim up to 50 kilometers per hour, which is amazingly fast for such a large dinosaur. Diet. Large dinos like Andysaurus and Limaesaurus. Now onto the weapons of Giganotosaurus. Giganotosaurus was one of the largest theropods ever, even longer than the T-Rex. It had a 1.5 meter skull containing around 60 sharp teeth, which had a knife-like shape and serrated edges, made to pierce tough hide and tear off chunks of flesh. It possessed short arms and three-fingered clawed hands. Okay, now onto the stats of Sora Phaganax. Height, 4 meters at hips, 5 meters at head. Length, 12 to 13 meters. Weight, up to 5 tons. Bite force, probably approaching a ton, maybe two. Speed, 50 kilometers per hour. Diet, small sauropods and even other theropods. Now to the weapons of Sora Phaganax. Sora Phaganax was one of the largest carnivores of late Jurassic North America and possibly the largest land predator until the Cretaceous. Ray even gave an estimate of the body length of 15 meters and Chur of 14, though later estimations have been lower. Like Allosaurus, Saurophaganax likely used a slashing axe bite. It also possessed some of the most powerful arms of any theropod. Now onto the advantages of Giganotosaurus. Giganotosaurus was larger and heavier. He possessed a stronger bite, but as we all know, bite force can be overrated. Now onto the disadvantages of Giganotosaurus. It's tough to find disadvantages, but the brain of Giganotosaurus was the size of a banana, so it's possible that A. Maximus was slightly more intelligent. Although it seems unlikely that a more evolved dinosaur like Giganotosaurus is going to be dumber than older, less evolved dinosaurs. It's hard to tell. It's possible that Giganotosaurus would be slower and less agile due to its size. His arms appear to be smaller and less functional. Now onto the advantages of Sora Phaganax. Well, it was perhaps more intelligent. It was likely faster and more agile. His arms certainly appear to be longer and more functional. Now onto the disadvantages of Sora Phaganax. Sora Phaganax was smaller and lighter and could have been toppled more easily. The weak jaws and slashing axe bite may have been ineffective when fighting Giganotosaurus. Okay, let's fight. Sora Phaganax and Giganotosaurus enter a clearing in the forest. The body of a dead Limaesaurus is situated in the center. Jigga charges first, attempting to scare the Soro. But Soro isn't taking any shit and charges also. Both dinosaurs clash in the middle of the clearing, clawing and biting. Both dinosaurs are evenly matched, but Giganotosaurus has a more effective bite in this scenario and clamps down on Soro's neck. Soro breaks free and bites Jigga. Jigga bites Soro. Soro claws back. It's a deep wound. Jigga is pissed clamps down on Soro's neck again, not letting go. It's the end for Soro. Verdict. While Giganotosaurus is larger, heavier, and more evolved, it makes sense that Jigga would win around 80% of the time, every time. They've done studies, you know. 60% of the time, it works every time. That doesn't make sense. Yes, that doesn't make sense. But uh, which dinosaur battle would you like to see next? Please let me know in the comments below and I might make it. Until next time, thank you for watching Mega Top 10s and subscribe to Viral Tira.